All of our actions are based on two motives, the desire to become great and sexual attraction. Only the complete absence of sex can be considered a sexual deviation, all the rest is a matter of taste. Everything you do in bed is fine and absolutely right, as long as both of you like it. If there is this harmony, then you and only you are right, and all those who judge you are perverts. A man never gives up anything, he just replaces one pleasure with another. A man who lacks sex talks about sex, a hungry man talks about food, a man who has no money talks about money, and our oligarchs and bankers talk about morality. Sexual gratification is the best sleeping pill. We strive more to take suffering away from ourselves than to gain pleasure. I am able to endure a lot of worries, to endure all difficulties, if I am not alone. We do not choose each other by chance. We only meet those who already exist in our subconscious. How brave and self-confident one becomes when he gains the conviction that he is love. Love itself is suffering, as deprivation decreases one's sense of self-worth, but mutual love, the possession of a beloved object, increases it again. When an old maid gets a dog, and an old bachelor collects figurines, in this way the former compensates for the absence of married life, and the latter creates the illusion of numerous love victories. All collectors are a kind of Don Juan.